This is the fourth GXS video and it takes a more detailed look at the GXS green mode. A standard feature of all GXS vacuum pumps is the ability to go into a green mode or energy saving mode whenever the pump is not actually needed for process duty but needs to be kept fully warmed up and ready for immediate use. This mode can also be referred to as AUC, Active Utility Control, or we say that the GXS is off process. This mode is typically used between batches or cycles of intermittent vacuum processes. Going into green mode, several things happen. Firstly, the rotational speed of the DP, the dry screw pump, reduces from normal full speed 110 Hz to 80 Hz in order to save electrical energy. If a mechanical booster MB is fitted, then this also reduces in speed from normal 102 Hz down to 20 Hz, which saves further energy. On MD or MD plus versions of GXS, the internal solenoid valve controlling the switchable gas ballast also closes to save purge gas while the pump is off process. If there is an optional inlet isolation valve fitted to the GXS and wired for control into the accessory deconnector on the rear of the pump, then this isolation valve automatically closes whenever the GXS is off process in green mode. And finally, if the GXS remains in green mode for a long period and the DP temperature does eventually drop below the set point, then, by default, the GXS auto rewarm function automatically increases the DP speed for a short period until the correct temperature is regained. All of the purging on the GXS is handled and controlled by the purge gas manifold block which you can see clearly here and all of its connections through to the different ports to feed the purge gas through. On this GXS uh, 450 screw pump you can see there are the two controls for the gas ballast. Gas ballast 1 has a manual needle valve, gas ballast 2 has a solenoid valve which can be commanded to be open or closed. The function of green mode on the GXS can most easily be shown using the optional PDT pump display terminal which I can plug in here and actually display the rotational speeds of the dry screw pump and of the booster which come up on the display there. We have the MB mechanical booster speed 102 hertz and the DP dry pump speed 110 hertz. These are the normal on process full speeds of the pumps. Now if I use the dashboard to put the pump into AUC mode by pressing the start button briefly like that and putting it into AUC, you'll notice that immediately the booster speed will drop and that will end up at 20 hertz. The dry pump speed will drop and that will end up at 80 hertz. So these are the default settings for the green mode on GXS pumps, on all GXS pumps just wait till they reach those speeds. So the MB is now at 20 hertz. DP is coming down. And the DP is now at 80 hertz. So we're now in green mode, energy saving mode. Using the dashboard now to come out of AUC, out of green mode, I just press the start button again. and the speeds rise back to normal full pumping speeds and of course going into green mode or off process will have resulted in any attached uh, inlet isolation valve being closed and the gas ballast, switchable gas ballast being switched off. Now we're back at full speed the booster is 102 Hz and the dry pump at 110 so when the GXS is switched into green mode or AUC, the inlet isolation valve would close if it's connected to the GXS and we say it's gone off process. At the same point, any switchable gas ballast would switch off. So going into green mode now results in the gas ballast being switched off and only the residual purges still operating. As we come out of green mode again, of course the gas ballast will switch back on. There are two other specific functions associated with green mode and these are best shown on the pump display terminal. 
The auto rewarm function is enabled by default on a GXS and this means that if the pump stays in green mode for a long period of time and actually does get a little too cold, the pump will speed itself up and automatically rewarm itself up to the proper temperature before then going back to the standard AUC or green mode speeds. The other possibility is auto AUC. If the process may be delayed and the pump would normally start up and then need to be in standby by default, then auto AUC can be enabled so that when the pump's warmed up, it automatically goes into AUC and waits in standby mode until the process is ready to be evacuated. Green mode energy savings can be illustrated for a GXS 250-2600 combination. In normal operation, on process, the typical energy consumed at ultimate pressure for this model will be approximately 5.3 kilowatts. In green mode, off process, with reduced speeds for the MB and DP, the energy consumption reduces to approximately 3.5 kilowatts, an energy saving of around 34%. It is of course possible to switch the MB off completely and to reduce the DP speed still further using the GXS second speed function, resulting in even lower energy consumption between process cycles. This approach can be useful in certain applications where pump temperature is not critical and where further energy savings may be useful.